Hi, in this tutorial I'll be looking at how to set markers to the music beats using either the auto beat detector or manually. I've brought in an audio clip with a very distinctive beat. Right click on the track and select show music beat track. The audio is placed. Next, right click and select use automatic music beat detection. We now see the waveform clearly and have a number of options. The slider control offers adjustment for the minimum time between beat markers. Note, it is a minimum time. Adjust the minimum time between beat markers and select Detect. The automatic beat detection doesn't have to pick up all the spikes in the audio. More auto-detect markers have been added. By positioning the slider and selecting Add, I can add markers manually. I've brought in a heartbeat audio file, a distinctive beat everyone should recognise. <laughs> Lowering the slider to 0.5 and then select Detect. The auto markers are placed, but not to every heartbeat. I'll add some manually. Position slider and click add. All very easy. Moving on, I use the marker beat to align photos. Hmm, a bit quick. Playing through, you can now imagine what's achievable with marker beat identification. I'll bring down a recently released solo. The beat is distinctive. I'll move the slider to the higher beat minimum and automatic music beat detection picks up the right markers. Zooming in closer will show the marker positions more clearly. Sitting in my armchair looking at the rain Where does all the water go running down the drain? Dream about a holiday warm and far away England in the summertime, it's raining every day Waiting for a change to come yeah, I'm waiting for a change to come It's the wettest day A nice bit of singing. Okay, now to do something with the markers. Select Apply and the markers are positioned on the music beat track. I'm aiming to split a video clip at a beat marker using the music to create a sound to invite a change in scene. At the beat point, the video changes. I'll add another clip and repeat. I'm not trying to be perfect here, just showing the way. <laughs> Adding more video and the method is repeated. With plenty of video clips to choose from, a movie is gradually built up. Many editors use the smart sound feature found in Magic Music. I do too. Placing a smart sound file in the music track shows no waveform and the use automatic music beat detection is unavailable. Here's a workaround. First, stretch out the smart sound audio to the full length you want. Disable all other audio tracks. Uncheck the box. Move to produce. Select to output as an audio. I'm selecting Windows Media Audio and 128 kilobits CD quality. Click Start to produce the audio from the Smart Sound file. 
The produced audio is now placed into the project and the music beat detection applied. The smart sound file can be removed as it is no longer needed. Choose the right audio for your project and you'll be okay. Thank you for watching my video on music beat detection in PowerDirector 10.